Hey hockey players, Coach Garner here from HockeyTraining.com. In this video, I want to talk to you about how you can become more confident. But first, I want you to imagine that you've been asked to do a 30-minute speech in front of 5,000 people live. That might get you pretty nervous, right? That might shake your confidence a little bit. But now imagine the producer or director comes up to you at the very last minute and says, okay, never mind. You're not going to need to do the 30-minute speech. All I need you to do is go up there and recite the alphabet one time. Uh, the entire weight of the world is going to be lifted off your chest. It's going to be off your shoulders. You're going to walk up there with a smile on your face, no problem. Recite the alphabet and then get off the stage like it was absolutely nothing. You still got up there. But what was the difference between situation one and situation two? Your foundation. Your foundation. How many times have you said the alphabet? How many times have you recited it? This is something that you could do anywhere, anytime, any place, and not screw it up. No matter what the environment is or no matter what your mindset was like prior to doing that. That's what a foundation is. A foundation is built upon repetition. Therefore, Confidence is built upon repetition as well. If you're about to go do a 30-minute speech, you might say some things you've never said before. You might have never done a speech that long. You may have never spoken in front of that many people before. A lot of things start to build up as question marks. And whenever you have question marks, you have hits against your confidence. You have a decrease in confidence. But if you have a foundation that eliminates all of the question marks, then nothing can shake your confidence. You're about to go out there and do the job that you're supposed to do because you know that you can do it. That is what confidence in hockey is all about. What is your foundation? What is your foundation? I'm asking you this. What is it right now? How focused are you on your nutrition? How focused and consistent are you in your hockey training program? Do you attend practice every single week? Do you give it your absolute all in practice every single week? How much are you doing with your dry land work? Are you doing skill work on the ice and off the ice? Have you taken it upon yourself to perhaps rent ice before or find a local pond and focus on your skills there? Or um, in Canada, we make hockey rinks in our own backyard throughout the winter and you can focus on your skill development at that. How, what are you doing? Because don't be surprised if you're nervous before your hockey game if you haven't built your own foundation yet i know that may seem harsh but don't act all surprised if you're intimidated to go out on the ice if you're not paying attention to your nutrition not paying attention to your training not giving it your all in practice and not finding every way in which to improve your foundation confidence is like a muscle you need to build it like anything else through repetition. It gets worked out, it recovers, it comes back. It gets worked out, it recovers, and it comes back. Your foundation can be built anywhere in life. This is an ideology that could be utilized in if you're intimidated talking to strangers, if you're intimidated talking to girls, if you're intimidated talking to your coach or to the scout about something that you were trying to do in the ice or something that you wanted to change. All of this stuff gets a lot scare, a lot less scary over time through repetition. If you've done it enough times, you're going to build confidence in it and your foundation is going to get that much, much bigger. But it has to be accompanied in everything that the foundation is a part of. So if you have your training, your nutrition, your skill development on check, you will be more and more and more confident as time goes on. And then the more and more times you step out into the ice, that's the repetition that's ultimately going to build your confidence. Confidence is built from the inside and then ex ex exerts itself to the outside world. You can't have confidence built from the outside world that makes its way into the inside. What do I mean by that? Confident people don't look for validation. That's what arrogant people do. There's a big difference between confidence and arrogance. Somebody who's arrogant wants to be told they're the man, what needs to be told by the team and by the crowd and by the coach that they're the man, or they aren't confident. A confident person who's naturally confident due to their foundation will go out there and execute their skills confidently, independent of the opinions of those around them, okay? Preparation builds the foundation. The foundation builds your confidence and confidence will make you a better hockey player. Thanks for watching.